Just sitting here reminiscing with James Ferentino about his wife Michelle Lee's visit to Dallas when she did Roberta with That's Bob right. Hope in the Bob Hope Theater and your little infant, uh, I forget now, is a David boy or Michael, girl? Right. Yes, He's just boy. two years old. I think he was about no more than three or four months old. Oh, yes, at the he time. was a tiny little fellow, and she would run back to the yeah. dressing room between takes and all. But it's really great to have this chance to talk with you because, um, as you know, James Ferentino is on the lawyer's segment of the bold ones. And uh, it, is there going to be any major change this year, James? I don't know uh, in terms of major change. I know we're doing 11 as opposed to uh, the eight we were doing for the first two seasons. Uh, Does this please you? To do more? Yes, uh, yes. Well, what pleases me, on two counts. Number one, uh, the fact that we're doing more shows is, uh, is, is good. I w any more than 11, I think I would get a little disturbed about it because it still if, affords me the freedom to do motion pictures and, and any kind of television that I want to do. But also, it's, we're broadening the characters. I think we're getting more personal with, uh, with the Daryls and with uh, 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 Burl's character, Nichols. Uh, for instance, we're doing a love story. Uh, I fall in love with uh, a young lady, uh, and it's rather tragic. We haven't shot it yet, but I, <laughs> I understand it's very good, the script. Uh, is the guest star anyone we would know? I don't know yet, no. We, we're oh, having, we won't be shooting it for another three or four weeks, but I, we're getting into much more personalized areas and getting more out of the courtroom, you know. Uh, so in that in that way, it's a, it's a major change, I guess. I know one of the things that I saw you and Michelle do together last year was that musical, the first, first nine, nine months, months of the hardest. hardest. Right. <laughs> now, was that the first time you ever worked with Michelle? That was, uh, yes, it was. It was the first time, the very first time. We've worked together four times, uh, three three times since then, but four times all together, and uh, it was a ball. It was a gas. I enjoyed doing it. The first and you time were I singing? sang. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, were you nervous her. about having to do the singing and dancing? That time, yes. Uh, since then, we did uh, a couple of comedy shows together and a dramatic show. We did a, a, a special, uh, John Dos Passos USA, where we had I had a lot of singing to do and a lot of dancing. And by that, by the time we did that, I was cool, <laughs> no sweat. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it was fun, and, and working with Michelle is, is, a, is a, a great joy and pleasure for me because she has, she teaches me so much, you know, especially in music and comedy. And uh, it's a it's a marvelous give and take thing that uh, you can't always get when you're working with someone who you're not married to. You know, it's. it's we have the luxury of being married to one another and knowing each other that well. And being so comfortable. Yeah. But it doesn't always work that way for couples because sometimes they feel uh, that they can't be as frank as they might like to be. I, yeah, I think but uh, I think that, that enters into it. But uh, we have a, a pretty honest relationship, so I don't think we're afraid of anything like that. You know, my wife knows I'm a nut. <laughs> you know. I, your friends call you Jimmy, don't they? No, Jim. Jim, mm -hmm. all right. Okay. Um, is there any truth to this rumor that you and Michelle might do the musical version of Some Like It Hot? Who told you that? Oh, I picked it up. A little, a little I just picked that up. Well, we were no, asked it was, to. It was on television was yesterday. It? Was locally. it? Locally. Yeah, yeah, it was. Here Gets around. We were asked to. Uh, David Merrick was at our house last week, and I had only met the gentleman once before, and he asked us if uh, we'd be interested in playing... Uh, Michelle the Marilyn Monroe role and Tony Curtis role for myself. I don't know yet. We haven't made a decision. It's not until the fall, and uh, I really don't know. It sounds exciting, and if it all works out, I would love to, but I, at this point, I don't know. Well, is it that you just don't know if you want to get committed to something for that long? Because he'd probably tie you up for yeah, months. Yeah, and it months, also anyway. means uh, moving my son and everything back east for the run of the show or however long we would do it and it means really making a whole complete change you know uh, it's a, it's an exciting uh, idea and I would love to do it but there's so much involved that uh, I would have to wait and see if everything worked out all right in other words you're not an actor who's that eager to get back on the stage well I am but uh, there are many complications and you know, you say art for art's sake, but when there are two of you doing it, it's 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 much more difficult. Uh, I think it would be a gas to do. 
from maybe, those. Uh, maybe, Jim, are you uh, worried about that scene where you have to dress up like the girl? Well, I think that's primarily, <laughs> wait a minute, I think that's primarily why he came and asked me, because the problem with the role is that the guy has to be dressed as a woman through 50% of the show, at least. And although there are marvelous actors around who could fill that, that role easily, the problem comes at how good is he going to look as a, as a woman? And I guess David Merrick thinks I look good as a girl. I don't know. <laughs> you know so. Have you tried on any Michelle's wigs? Not dressed? lately. Not lately. But if we sign the contract, I may be doing that, yes. Well, Jim, whatever you do, we'll look forward to seeing Thank it. You. And thanks so much for talking with us. And please give our best to I Michelle. I sure will. My pleasure.